Hey, what's up you guys? It's been a second since I posted a video uh, or since I filmed a video. I've been posting a lot. Hopefully you guys saw my mini documentary that went live seven days. If not, I will link it right below. Anyway, today's video is all about our plant-based on a budget meal, meal plan challenge. Uh -huh. happens every single year. I'm going to be doing this week the Daily Dozen How Not to Die Dr. Gregor meal plan that we created. It's been a crazy December of like indulgence. Lots of cookies. I was recipe testing so many cookie recipes and stuff so I have been eating not as healthfully as I would have liked and I've also been spending way more money than I wanted on like holiday gifts and travel and all of that. So this challenge is an opportunity for me to uh, kind of get grounded in healthier habits and kind of reset for the new year and I imagine many of you guys are feeling the same way just needing sort of a detox and a cleanse from the holidays and also needing to start the year right saving lots of money so that we're not stressed all year long <laughs> so I invite you to join me and also I'm gonna take you along with me for the fun uh -huh. Good morning friends and happy day one of our meal plan challenge I am in bed still I mean I've been up but I haven't really jumped into the food for today yet I'm getting some work done getting some emails done and uh, looking at the meal plan and figuring out what's happening today and this week so today we've got for breakfast a berry smoothie which that's very commonly a breakfast that I turn to is just a fruit smoothie it's really yummy really really yummy it's got sunflower seeds and flax seeds and banana, soy milk and frozen berries. Healthy and yummy. Cheers. So flax seeds is something that he encourages us to eat encourages us to eat every single day and the easiest way to do that is just dump it in your morning smoothie or oatmeal or your cereal something like that would be good. So starting the day with a smoothie, then for lunch I'm going to be having a hummus wrap. <laughs> I might have two of these depending how hungry I am, but it is loaded with delicious hummus, nice flavorful hummus, um, brown rice, spinach, tomatoes, and it's on this sprouted bread that I got from Trader Joe's. So again, the point of this specific meal plan that I'm doing is showing how to eat super healthfully according to Dr. Greger's plan, but on the tightest budget possible. So I'd love to have a wrap with avocado all up in there and stuff, but that's pricey, it's expensive. So this, what Tony and I have done in this meal plan is we found a way to make it as cheap as possible. And then for dinner, a turmeric veggie rice bowl. So this is gonna have tofu and onion, garlic, broccoli, frozen peas, carrots, turmeric, kale, brown rice, really basic, super healthy ingredients. And then that, between those three meals, I'm gonna be checking off everything in the Daily Dozen. I figured I'd show you guys quickly what these meal plans are all about. So when you get the meal plan, you get this ebook that has lots of information in it, some tips for grocery shopping, blah, 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 and then your meal plan. So it breaks down what you're eating every day for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. For each meal, there is a recipe. Um, and every recipe has a beautiful photo taken by yours truly, me. And we have like some healthy tips at the bottom. The other cool thing is that they all come with a printer-friendly shopping list. So it outlines exactly what you need to get at the store. And that's a wrap for day one of the plant-based on a budget meal plan challenge, daily dozen style. Chance, you wanna say hi? Oh, you wanna say hi, Chance? Chance is uh, joining along, eating his V-Dog, healthy every day, all day, every day. Anyway, I'd love you to join me if you're interested. We also have a Facebook community support group that you can um, get lots of camaraderie uh, through that. So if you want to get the meal plans, plantbasedmealplan.com. And yeah, until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.